YouTube, Niner Empire, what is going down? Welcome back to another video. So the 49ers have gotten good injury news um, just about an hour or so ago. Um, this injury news came after, obviously, I uploaded a couple videos about the Trent Williams um, situation, the, the McCaffrey situation, and the Debo situation. But good news is for the 49ers, Debo Samuel and Trent Williams, both of their injuries suffered in yesterday's loss versus the Cleveland Browns are considered day-to-day. -day. Um, they are not serious whatsoever. Both are expected to play against the Minnesota Vikings next Monday night. Um, that's, I think, the news everybody was kind of hoping for. Now, as far as Christian McCaffrey, he is still undergoing an MRI to determine the severity of his oblique injury. Um, but the good news is, is, you know, Trent Williams is an anchor piece for this offense. Um, there, there's not a lot of NFL, or there's not a lot of left tackles in the league like him. He's the best at what he does. Um, and he is huge for Brock Purdy and protecting his blind side. So to hear that he's day-to-day -day with an ankle ankle injury is very good. He doesn't even have an ankle sprain. That That's what... Um, that's what came out today is that he, he missed an ankle sprain. He does not have a high ankle sprain or an ankle sprain to any degree. Um, thing is with those high ankle sprains, those can be tricky because a lot of times with the high ankle sprains, I've seen it with Jimmy Garoppolo. I can't tell you how many times when he was with San Francisco, uh, we've seen it with Debo too. I mean, those high ankle sprains can keep players out for a month to six weeks, uh, depending on how, how severe an ankle sprain is. So to hear that he, he missed on, a, on an ankle sprain, that, that, that's not what he was diagnosed with, is massive. Um, and then, of course, the Debo Samuel, he had that shoulder injury. Um, everything was intact with that. Um, and like I said, him, and along with Trent Williams being day-to-day -to -day with their injuries, is massive. Um, so we still await on the MRI for Christian McCaffrey. I, I would imagine we're going to we, – I mean, we should get good news as well on that. Like I said earlier in, in, in today's video, I, I don't believe Christian McCaffrey's injury is anything to, to be serious about. Um, it looked like he, he ran off into the locker room just fine. So the 49ers' expectation is that the McCaffrey injury is not serious either. Um, but obviously getting that MRI helps the 49ers determine how long he could be out and things of that nature. So good news for the 49ers when it comes to injuries. Um, this extra day of rest going into this Monday night game is going to be massive for, for all three of those players to get rested up. Um, Debo, I expect to, to suit up. Trent Williams, I expect to suit up. Um, and then obviously with Christian McCaffrey, that's a little bit different. He's probably has the more severe injury out of all three of them. Um, but with McCaffrey, you also, like I said in earlier's video, you also have to take into account his usage, usage in the system. Um, and knowing how, how much the 49ers use him, that could determine um, if he's out or not. So stay tuned for, for an update on Christian McCaffrey, but as far as Debo Samuel and Trent Williams, those guys are expected to play next week, um, and that's huge for the 49ers, especially going into Minnesota um, on a road game Monday night next week.